Well hi guys, it's George from Cyprus Insight. And where am I today? Well, I'm in the lower road. Down there is Brodara. In that direction is Capo Greco and Ayanepa. And as I say, this is a lower road up the top end, and I'm going to turn the camera off, it's going to be dark and you're probably not going to see a lot. Up that end is the high road, the one with the big slope. Oh, I do like the big slope. And that goes up to Ayanapa Sculpture Park. And I'm going to just cross the road because here comes the bus. There's the bus stop just a little bit further up from the restaurant that we're going in. Let me just walk along. Get off the road because he'll run me over, won't he? Because I don't think he's stopping at the moment. There we are, that's the 102. And the 101 comes from the other direction. So if you're staying in Brodara, guys, or Ayanapa, and you fancy coming down to this restaurant, there's your bus stop right outside the restaurant, or virtually outside, should I say. Now let me get off the road and I'll show you what the restaurant looks like. There it is, a traditional Cypriot restaurant. Oh, there goes the 101. There we are, Konos Grill Cuisine, guys. And 99% of the ingredients comes from their own farm. All free range stuff. Let's go in and have a look at the menu. There's the grilled halloumi, just four euros 50, very delish. Greek salad, four and seven euros. Very reasonable, everything seems to be very reasonable at the moment. Barbecue platter for one person, 18 euros. In the pita bread, we've got souvlaki, chef de yes. Now that's what I'm gonna have. What are you going to have? Mixed. You're going to have the mixed kebab, and look, very reasonable, guys. Nine euros. We've got a children's menu, including halloumi. Extras, pita bread, and we're going to have chips. And there's the Greek side, guys. Exactly the same thing, but in Greek. Thank you. So, spirits, cocktails, all very reasonably priced, and a slow beer is just three euros fifty. And soft drinks are just two euros. So everything is very reasonably priced, guys. And of course, don't forget, guys, 99% of the ingredients comes from his farm. Wow, look at the size of that. That is enormous. Proper Cypriot chips. Delish. Ooh. Is that the mixed one? Yeah. Well, that's, that's bigger than mine. That's amazing. There's this little Facebook page, guys. And it says here, Konos food is 99% supplied by a family farm. Fresh vegetables, fruits, eggs, olive oil, halloumi and yogurt, without chemicals, which is very rare nowadays to find. Well, that is perfectly delish, guys. Mmm, 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 those chips are delish. Get them in before the crew gets them. Oh no, have you discovered the chips? <laughs> oh no, Greedy Chops has discovered the chips before I could eat them up. The chef de yes are amazing, delish. <laughs> Try your kebab. What you got there? A bit of pork. Oh yeah, is that nice? Mm. Can I try just a little bit of your pork? Mm. Cheers. Oh wow, that is mmm mmm. That is good. That is delish. Oh yeah. Guys, I've stolen another bit of pork off the crew because it really is delish. That's the best pork I've had for years. How many chef de years you got in your mixed kebab? Two. 
Wow, they're massive. Try one. I've had. You have done. Mm. They are delicious, aren't they? Very delicious. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh. I think you can tell that the ingredients has come from a free-range farm, can't you? It just tastes different. Sort of double delish. Right, guys, that was a bit of a gem, wasn't it? And this is another gem. Look at that. We've got two slopes. We've got one slope going to the outdoor area and another one going out for the exit. So I'm going to do a little video for the outdoor area, guys. Obviously quiet at the moment. It is March. And look, we've got lovely plants. Oh, disabled car parking right outside. Look at this, guys. So we've got disabled car parking and then this lovely terrace area. I do like the slope straight into the restaurant. A great location, as I said, we've got the bus stops outside. And of course, we've got some traditional Cypriot antiques on the wall. Beautiful doors. Oh look, Greedy Chop's fork and then Greedy Chop's spoon for her breakfast. That should do it, shouldn't it? Right, so let's go out and show you the location again, guys, because this really is a little gem. There's the bus stops over there. Oh, there's the 102 going to a Napa. There it goes. And it's just one euro 50 still, guys, per ride, or five euros for a day trip on the buses. So guys, this is a little gem. 99% of the ingredients coming from his family farm. Good value for money. Lots of food for your money. Delish. It really is a little gem. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's somewhere you'd like me to go, put it in the comments below.